All right, guys, welcome back to the next video on the channel. And today, what we're going to be talking about is the adventure effect of spatial rend, the move that Origin Form Power Code does get from the Sinnoh Tour. Now, unfortunately, if you didn't choose the um, Pearl Medal, I don't believe you can get this, which is unfortunate, but you can trade it, I believe, with other people. So, let's see what this does. So, trainers can activate this effect with associated with Spatial Rend by using 5,000 star Stardust and 5 Palkia Candy. And this distorts space for 10 minutes, allowing for encounters with wild Pokemon to be at an increased distance. This is the one that most people will use on a daily basis, just to get that additional, like, 80 meters for around your character. Now, it doesn't say anything about interacting with gyms. So, that's unfortunate. But you can extend the timer by use, by 10 more minutes by using more Stardust and more Palkia Candy, if we know this. And it can be up to 24 hours after 2 hours each. Now as you see here, this is a little animation of what will happen when you use it. You'll get this additional ring around you. A few months back, it came out as a bug, in quotes. Because I believe they were testing this and it got pushed to live by accident. Now if that was the case, then it was definitely a bug and needed to be removed. However... I would prefer them to keep it and then give this a different move, basically. Not a different move for Spatial Ren, but a different effect. Because it was already out, basically. But it is the one that most people will use because you want them additional Pokemon. You want to be able to, while you're playing, like on a comm day, find more Pokemon. And obviously, if you use a gotcha and things like that while you're at work, it gives you that additional space just to get into that next bit where more Pokemon could be. So it, it helps with that as well. Um, so for me, this is the better one for normal play. If you're playing during an event, you're going to have increased incense and incre increased laws anyway for con days. So this would help with getting more Pokemon into your radius. However, the only difference will be if there's like three or four times Stardust on a con day, you are going to be wanting to use a star piece plus Dialga's power just to get more from your star piece. But I do think this is the one that most people will use more on a daily basis. Maybe for Dialga you might use it for daily incense. But I think this one is going to be the best one just for general play. Um, so I would be walking Dialga and Palkia to get more candies because this is going to cost a lot. 5 candy doesn't sound like a lot but that's only for 10 minutes. If you want it for an hour that's 50. That's a lot of candy to use, and you only get, I believe, is it free for walking them? And I think it's 20 kilometers, so you've got a lot of stuff to go. Um, but it is a really good effect. I'm glad they're bringing stuff like this to Pokemon Go in 2024, as we did need something new to be coming to the game to bring people back, but also to make it more exciting. There's been a bit of a letdown in content recently, and this is definitely a good one for the game. So let me know what your thoughts are down below in the comment section. Please leave a like on the video, and also subscribe to the channel if you are new, and I will speak to you all in the next one.